Good morning, Matt. You know, we have a big happy birthday message this morning going out to Google. Google is turning 15 today, and like at any good birthday party, they have a pinata to be a part of the party. So if you go to Google's homepage this morning, you will see this, which is called the Google Doodle. And this is what Google does on their homepage. Every time there's a really big event, they switch it accordingly. And today they have a scene from a birthday party. And if you want to participate, all you have to do is press that play button, and you will see a pinata drops down, and it's actually a game that you can play and let me tell you I am pretty sure this is gonna be popular around offices around Western New York and around the world because these are always trending topics and people are always talking about them I know it started quite the battle here so <laughs> I wanted to know what everybody's best scores were we're good hearing lots of high scores I know Phil scored a 144 he tweeted us that uh, Liz also tweeted us saying she got a 145 and I have to tell you I have not heard a higher score than News 4's Anthony Kaji he had a 185 on the game and he was very excited about that so congrats to Anthony let us know your high scores and also let us know your favorite coffee because we'll be talking about that coming up back to the studio for her next .com check. Hi, Em, are we talking coffee right now? We are talking coffee right now. As Lauren mentioned earlier, it's National Coffee Day. So we thought we would take this opportunity to see your favorite coffees. I asked on Facebook this morning, and no surprise, lots of people, we're in Buffalo, are just saying Tim Hortons. Lots of people love their Tim Hortons in the morning. Um, Alicia says she has an espresso with coffee. Um, vanilla coffee mate and total opposite of Maya who says she will drink anything as long as it's black coffee so she's tough <laughs> log on let us know your favorites maybe you'll get some good ideas from the other viewers here now we're talking about coffee day but we're also talking about everything happening around Western New York this weekend and lots of people are headed to Lewiston James says he's going to the Lewiston Harvest Festival Jim says he's going to the Wildlife Festival in Lewiston and much much more so log on let us know what you're up to this weekend and I know one thing I'm excited to see this weekend is more of the changing leaves. I love taking drives to see the beautiful leaves around Western New York, and we're continuing in to get great pictures of them. Carlton sent us in this picture from Gasport, where you can just see the leaves starting to change. Very, very pretty. So we want to thank him for sending that picture in, and remind you that if you get a great picture, go to wivb.com and send it over to us. You'll see if you scroll over, report it. You can go down to submit photos and video. That's where you click, and all you have to do is fill out your name, co contact information if you want, and just upload your picture. You can describe what's happening in the picture, and then all you need to do is click on weather and nature, and that will send right over to us. So we'll definitely be sharing these pictures as they come in, and of course, we'll be putting them right into our fall foliage photo gallery. So send those over to us. I'm sure lots of people will see them over the weekend, and now we're going to send it back over to Matt.